How's it guys? Welcome to Vilnius in Lithuania. We're just quickly packing up the car. Oh, we're just popping some of our stuff in the car. And we're gonna go for breakfast at our hotel. Yeah, luck. If you haven't checked it out yet, I would urge you to go and look at those other videos. Yesterday we did a free walking tour. The night before we were just trying some interesting food. Well, both days we tried some interesting food. Very good. Okay, let's go get breakfast. breakfast room. Oh, it looks very good. It smells good. On the menu, we've got some dumplings with meat, omelette. This is, I'm, I'm telling you. This I'm going to have some of that, yeah. yeah. I'm going to. Then we've got rice porridge, beans and tomato sauce, stir-fried veggies, and sausages. And then the usual, you know, corn, peas. Here's my little setup. Got some hams, sausages, baked beans, eggs, dumplings, mustard, yogurt. I went for cherry, because you know I love cherries. My dad gave me half of his orange and a little white coffee. So after punching in the uh, directions to the Hill of Crosses, um, <laughs> how far away is it, Dad? Two and a half hours. Two and a half hours, not necessarily in the direction of Riga, which is our next stop in Latvia. So we've decided to give it a miss, um, and we're just going to head straight to Riga. And then it also just means we'll have more time there, which will be good. That's where they make their clouds in Lithuania. <laughs> it's a cloud factory. And you see the reason why there's fewer clouds today is because they've turned off the big cloud factory over there. Look at that guy. Just a big old thermometer. Here we are, the nation of Latvia. Where the currency is the Lat. No, it's you. Yeah, yeah, no, but there, it used to be the Lat and they still, they might still accept it. Oh, I just Have had I just had a nap. What, Euros? No, laps. No, but in um, Cape Colored Afrikaans, a lat is a colloquial term for a penis. Either that town is very far away, or it's just small buildings. We've just stopped on the side of the road to have a little stretch, stretch our legs. My dad's having a smoke over there. Sad little pickle. Here we go, Riga. We are here, and now we just need to find somewhere to stay. Big bridge for trains there. There's a nice old building. You guys can't really see because of this railing, but it's going to be plenty to do, I think. Oh, another nice bridge there. And there's the flag. Yeah, it's a big flag, eh? So we found our hotel. Uh, well, this is the one that we just briefly found online. Islande Hotel, Riga. But the old town is over there, on the other side of the river. So when we were going over the bridge now, that was us going in the wrong direction. All right, here we go. Let's, okay, wait, let me get my bags in and I'll do a little room tour here. We've got a nice big mirror. It's a bathroom. Oh, it's a bath in here. Toilet, another mirror. What's up? And through here, we got our two single beds. Bedside lamps, little desk. We can make some coffee, teas in the morning. Little TV, mini bar fridge, our own beers that we brought, and then a view of the other side. The other side, yeah. And there's the old town. That's where we're going later. So the beer we're drinking here, Tuski. Tuski. Yeah. Tuski. Cheers. Good driving today. I was mostly napping. I've had this one before, but I mean. Mmm, mm, is a good one. Even yeah. even slightly warm. It's not bad. It's off the shelf, it's not warm. <laughs> we are heading towards Old Town. We kind of skipped lunch just because we weren't both we both weren't particularly hungry. And uh, one of us fell asleep and had a little nap there. <laughs> I won't name names or point fingers. We're gonna head out and... Siesta is a necessity. Siesta is a necessity. Yeah, we're just gonna go and explore a little bit and we'll probably have an early-ish dinner. There might be some football on tonight because it's obviously the World Cup. But I'm gonna show you guys these clouds because they're ah, looking delicious again. Famous clouds, yeah. Look at them there, next to the Twin Towers. This is some high, high quality H2O. Good clouds. Our hotel was described as on the beach, and this is apparently the beach. They've got some 
football fields. But look at that thing. What? Big Not old that. ferry. Hey? No. <laughs> No, man. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> We've got to walk along this lovely bridge. A marvel, architectural marvel. I'll try and get some nice photos of it. I've got the camera out, but I think the photos will probably be better on the way back. Wherever you go, I go, me go, we go. <laughs> it's a bit of an old town wall, I'm assuming. Because I don't know what is built with a curve like that. There must have been a gate here or something. Surely, how to, I mean, and the cannon, I'm just guessing here. Little ice cream break, Schorle, Schorle, I don't know. I went for passion fruit and mango. What's it, mango? I think so. Oh, that's good. Mm. You want some? No, thanks. No, fine. Here's last. Uh, shall we go and have a look at mm. Sure. This menu served its purpose in that it attracted me with the pictures and it looks like the most sort of traditional thing that we found in the old town. Also they have a massive screen for the football on later. We're going to watch the Portugal versus Spain. What are you saying? Yebo. Yebo. They also have live music. These ladies playing the horizontal harp. I don't know what that's called. We popped into this little church. Well, I'm not so little. And um, I felt like it should be a good opportunity to capture. This is what happens all the time basically. My dad will go up to a restaurant, a store, and just start chatting to the people working there. And I'm like, shame, they're working, you know? Let them, let them do their thing. And he just goes and he just has a conversation. Just causing cuck. <laughs> Exhibit two. Just, I saw this thing, Latvian cuisine. So I went to go have a little look at the menu. And then obviously the hostess comes up to us and is now trying to get us to sit there. But she doesn't know what she's got herself into because old chatterbox. <laughs> Uh. <laughs> we've had enough walking so we've come back to Nak Nacht's, the restaurant, where they have the music players, horizontal harpists. And over there we've got the football, these are the highlights from yesterday. And of course my dad being a smoker enjoys it here because they've got Nakutnin. Nakutnin. Na yeah, I think you, you get it. By now you should know what time it is. We have gone for two of the local beers. Which are these actually? Nuck Nucks. It's a local brand of beer. Maybe it's that. I don't know which one. Something. But it's not whatever's on the glass. Unless it is. And she's deceived us. Either way. Cheers. Cheers. Nah. It's good. We just got offered some complimentary sausage, a little tasting platter. He's getting some photos taken. Mmm. That's good, eh? That's weighed my decision as well, because I was thinking of getting the grilled sausages with fresh cabbage, and that's what I'm getting now. This place is such a vibe, because we've got the football on there, and these ladies back there playing the horizontal harps are playing absolute treffers. This is uh, Rolling in the Deep, I think, by Adele. So it's, uh, it's really cool to hear kind of pop music classicalized. I'm going to roll with that. I'm gonna roll into the deep with that. <laughs> So our horizontal harp ladies, I wanted to go full alliteration there, but we won't go with horizontal harp harlots, but um, the horizontal harp ladies have left, and we now have what appears to be an oompa band, which is exciting because I've never seen one live, or even on TV, I don't think, and I'm a big fan of the tuba, my favorite fish. Our little oompa band has started. And the sausage... That's not hot. You I gave myself a fright there. Sausages have arrived. Goulash soup, how is it? Alright. Alright. I can tell you these are going to be good. So I'm not even going to give you a reaction because I just know. Quite windy, but we are back on the bridge. The bridge with all the stuff. And uh, we're heading back to the hotel now. Great food, great beer, great sports, great entertainment. Got some kayakers down there. Bit of a sunset. I mean, yeah, it's all right. Back at the hotel, it's time for Portugal versus Spain, and we've got some sweet treats here. Some halva. This one's all the way from Poland, um, so it's travelled with us, which means it's nice and a little bit greasy. You can see on my fingers there. Halva is made from sesame seeds, eh? Yes. 
So it's uh, it's basically like a dry tahini then, almost with a little bit of sugar. Because <laughs> isn't tahini <laughs> tahini is made from sesame seeds as well? Let's see what's in this. He goes, I have an idea, let's just burn it down. So that's, that's pretty much what he did. This is just the sort of general photo that I want. The bridge in there, whether it's zoomed in, zoomed out, that's when the sun is a little bit higher. Yeah, that's just kind of what I'm going for. I should take